Hey, good evening everybody. This is Dennis coming from Winnipeg. I hope you had a good Monday start of the week. My day has been really, really busy. I had uh, quite a few uh, computer issues. Uh, one of my printer died and one of the laptop died, so I had to replace the printer, reinstall it to all the workstations. And then um, replace the laptop and reinstall new program, uh, the program and etc. and put it back into the network. So it's it's been a fun uh, day. I work as IT today almost the whole day and then running around a little bit at the same time. My two kids are sick at home. So my sisters are staying at home with them. Grateful for that. Otherwise, uh, Sin and I wouldn't be able to uh, go to work today at all. So our day actually didn't end it until about 7.30 or so and then we got home at 8 o'clock and had supper. So with that running around and everybody sit, sick around you, I know that there's lots of people are sick today. Uh, two people at our work couldn't uh, make it in because of the either they themselves was uh, sick with cold or the you know their kids or family members sick and that they have to stay home and take care of it so i am trying to keep myself uh strong and uh, especially my immune system so i won't get sick because it's really really cold out in winnipeg right now and i think today average temperature was minus 30 degrees celsius and with the cold temperature hey out with a cold temperature, you can, you know, when your body's really stressed and you're not eating properly, your immune system can go down and you can get viral cold quite easily and it could last quite a bit. So what are you doing to boost your immune system? First of all, you know, trying to manage your stress. You know, the personal care, self-care is a huge thing. So I've tried to do more of the belly breathing, meditation, and making sure that, hi Isa, making sure that I get my seven to eight hours of sleep. The weekend was great. I caught up with my sleep. Uh, every uh, book, Saturday and Sunday, I got about uh, seven to eight hours of sleep. So this morning I woke up really refreshed and I was ready to go, but now I am tired because I had a long day with all the IT issues that I was dealing with. So before I go to bed, I'm going to try and do about uh, 12 minutes meditation to just clear my head so that I can sleep better and I can have a better sleep. The other thing that uh, I've done, as you many of you know that I'm into nutrition and I've done, uh, you know, practice metabolic and functional medicine for uh, over 15 years. So nutritional supplement to uh, support my stress and immune system is a huge thing for me. So I take a couple of different things. The basic, everybody knows that vitamin D, if you take enough dose, that actually, um, you know, not just good for a lot of other things, but it's really boosts the immune system. And then the other thing is uh, probiotic. And those are the two basic supplements that I suggest to a lot of people, uh, especially time winter time come, even you you know you're not getting sick or cold. It's as a pro preventative you should be taking vitamin D and uh, probiotic. Other stuff that I've been adding because I'm kind of uh, being really crazy busy last uh, a few months is that I drink. Uh, Rishi coffee or uh, tea. I have a red tea that infused with uh, cordyceps plus the Rishi mushroom. And then the coffee that I drink has a uh, Rishi mushroom in it. And then there's other immune herbs that I take. And of course, a uh, combination of different herbs for uh, managing my stress better. So I hope that this is helpful to give you some uh, pointer for how to boost your immune system. And if you're doing other things that I miss, definitely uh, comment below so we can share information. And of course, if you want to know more about other herbs and uh, stuff that I take, personal message me and I will uh, share those information with you. I hope you have a great evening and I will talk to you again tomorrow.